in Brazil. As we are in Brazil, I also saw floods, serious floods. We have to pray for Brazil. I just ask you to do this one more thing. Raise up a hand and make a prayer. Make a short prayer. And we start this bulletin with news coming in from Brazil. Flooding and landslides triggered by torrential rain in Brazil has claimed at least 36 lives on Carnival weekend in southeast Sao Paulo state. Drone footage shows a street next to the shore that collapsed into the beach with lampposts, cars and trees lying on the sand. As we are in Brazil, I also saw floods, serious floods. We have to pray for Brazil. According to Sao Paulo state government, the rainfall in the region has surpassed 600 millimeters in one day. One of the highest amounts ever in Brazil in such a short period of time. I saw some weather and this a heavy weathers. Let Malawi be protected from flash floods. These floods, these floods, we pray against destruction. We pray against destruction. A state of emergency has been declared in Malawi after a tropical storm, Freddy, struck the country for a second time at killing more than 100 people. Rescue workers describe being completely overwhelmed by the rainfall and mudslides. The cyclone is one of the longest running in history and has caused havoc across parts of southern Africa. Uh, what do we know about the damage that has been caused here? Well, what we've heard so far is that uh, there's huge infrastructural damage um, houses that were swept away in these flash floods. Um, we've seen images of roads washed away as well as bridges. Uh, for a, lot, a better part of yesterday, the electricity in the commercial capital of Blantyre was down. Let Malawi be protected from flash floods. So we pray that these weathers, as we speak now, that let there be protection over these nations.